Gold has been a prized metal throughout human history, but it's not just valuable for its beauty and rarity. Gold is also a major commodity traded around the world, with a complex market that involves many different players. In this video, we'll take a closer look at the international gold market, how it works, and who's involved. Part 1. The Physical Gold Market The first part of the gold market is the physical market, which involves the buying and selling of actual gold bullion. The physical market is dominated by central banks, governments, and large institutional investors, who hold gold as a reserve asset. The World Gold Council estimates that there are around 200,000 metric tons of gold above ground, with a total value of around $11 trillion USD as of 2021. Part 2. The Gold Futures Market The second part of the gold market is the futures market, where traders and investors buy and sell contracts that represent a certain amount of gold at a future date. The futures market allows buyers and sellers to hedge against price fluctuations and provides liquidity for the physical market. In 2021, the total value of gold futures outstanding was estimated to be around $400 billion USD. Part 3. The Gold Options Market The third part of the gold market is the options market, which allows traders to buy or sell the right to buy or sell a certain amount of gold at a certain price within a certain time frame. The options market is much smaller than the futures market, with a total value of around $25 billion USD in 2021. Part 4. Major Players in the Gold Market The gold market involves many different players, including miners, refiners, bullion banks, exchanges, and retail investors. Mining companies extract gold from the ground, while refiners process it into bullion bars and coins. Bullion banks provide financing and other services to the market, while exchanges like the COMEX and the LBMA facilitate trading. Retail investors can buy gold through ETFs, coins, or bars. The international gold market is a complex ecosystem that involves many different players and markets. From central banks to retail investors, the market for gold is constantly evolving, driven by supply and demand, geopolitical events, and monetary policies. As a safe haven asset, gold will likely continue to play an important role in the global economy for years to come. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more content about finance, economics, and technology.